hello guys welcome back today I will show you how to using sorry I will show you how to know the difference between return and echo in function for example I will create a function let's create a new function uh, views this function will store all visitors of our website let's create a variable views equals 200 this variable equals 100 this function allows arguments views this function will take will echo views plus one so views plus one let's call this function views will equals views this is our function okay let's say the result in the browser we have one visitor okay this echo if I used return reload no value echo as a screen okay I don't need the user when he visit our website say the visitors so I will use return not echo because echo will printing your the value as a screen when you calling the function so if you use return you can using echo by enter echo before your before your function name echo yes it gives the same the same result okay for more you can use a var dump function and enter your function control v in the browser sorry this our function this our value let's use echo the result null it gave us a null this a null value you can't use this in any operation if I say if if the views equal equal 201 it will echo down let's say result no anything happen why it's equal the same value look this value is printed why it not not happen let's see also reload nothing happen why it doesn't happen because it contains null value echo contains null value if you use return say what having done look done and it uh, contains a value this a very simple lesson about the difference between return and echo and php thanks for watching goodbye